Okay, I think we're set. We're set to um, Dr. Brundle's office. It's locked. So where do we need to go? I'm going back to holding. I don't think I spent very much time in there. Or what was in there? Okay. I think. Oh shit. Okay, that's broken. Okay, in holding, I think that was where the um, vice grip is. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to use that vice grip for something. Did I just go in the wrong room? Yeah, I did. Okay. This map confuses me a little bit. Alright, that door is broken. Uh, can't go in there yet. Actually, I think I remember. I want to keep the knife. I like the knife. It was. It was really good. There we go. Whoa. Just play the game like this. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Keep the game like this. Get my ass kicked by everything. Oh, lockpick. Perfect. Cause since the last vi- Oh. Cause uh, since the last video, I kind of forgot that there was a locked door. Ah, uh, maybe I'll start shooting these guys. Yeah, I'm gonna start shooting them. Might be more! Sounds like there is more. Where are you at? I'm gonna shoot you. Eh. Hey, right, there's... There's an aim function with the iron sights, but I, like, never use it. Lab, don't want that. That's right, I gotta get to the other side here. Yeah, let's whistle at it. Alright, what's in here? Also, Dr. Brundle? Is that like the Brundle fly from the fly? Is that a reference? Let's take the leg. Sweep the leg. The eyes have been eaten. I don't know what that was. But, uh... The hell? Dr. Brundle, personal archive number 90. I can't get out of here. The halls are full of them. They're worshipping Piccinini's messed up pet. They swim around just like the rats. Okay. Can we open this? There's nothing in there. Game freaking out. So I'm seeing a lot of Unity Engine debug log missing item info. So now that I grab this. Wait, did this grab the whole body? Oh no, this is happening again. Great.
see if you can fix that. Um, well, it looks like I grabbed the entire body, so. Reload! Reload! Okay, where am I going? There's another locked door somewhere. Um... I could try using the retinal scan, but he doesn't have any eyeballs. So... Am I supposed to go find his eyeballs? Like, why'd I take his whole body? Oh, what? They respawn? Great. Um... There goes all my ammo. Oh, oh, okay, D never mind. Guess I'll start using a shitty shotgun. This thing's gonna get me killed, man. I don't like the shotgun. It's weak. The, the dog? Is it really you, dog? No, bring back the wobble bread. I don't like you. I like the wobble bread. Dr. Brundle, personal archive number 91. Dr. Piccinini went crazy. He attacked me in my office, screaming about sacrifice. I hit him over the head, and he lost consciousness. <laughs> that asshole. But I confirmed he is still alive. Aww. I'm going to try to get out of here using the flood tunnels connected to the rat fluid chamber. Is that this? Uh, yup it is. That's nasty. Did my dog fall back down there? Ugh, what a useless animal. It looks like that's broken. That's broken too. It sure is dark in here. Um, flashlight. I can't see. I'm just looking at a black screen. With ammo. There we go. A door leading to where? Can I open? No. Okay then. May I open? Ah, fuck, I gotta get my phone. Uh, one second. Problem. Now, where were we? Oh, these are the tools I need. Wait, what did I say? 
I just dropped his whole body, including his severed leg right there. Okay. That's cute. Open. Oh, ammo. How I need ammo. Broken. So only came in here for ammo? Oh. Where the fuck are you going with a, a leg, a broken leg, a chunkier leg missing? Dr. Brundle, personal archive number 92. I'm almost out of here, but Piccinini's pet is in the warehouse by the emergency exit. It won't move while I'm staring at it, but when I try to look away, it seems to reappear somewhere within the closer radius. If someone finds this, please be careful, as the creature may still be around. Okay, that sounds like fun. And we all know I'm here to have fun. But for whatever reason, I decided to start playing this game. I'm not totally miserable, but I guess it's okay. Is that not a save point? Wow, okay. Getting generous with the save points now. Kind of wish I had that earlier, but I won't complain. Too much. It's like a warehouse. Examine. Nothing. A big old stinky warehouse. So what am I looking for exactly? This pet? My pet? Go. A left eye. Okay. Just picking up eyeballs now. Um. Wait, I look away and it, like, reappears somewhere? Is that what it said? Is that it? Whoever that is? <laughs> Return the slab! Oh, wow. Kinda just appeared out of nowhere. Fuck you, Ramses. Am I dead? Just tell me. Am I dead? Am I dead, Ramses? I didn't return the slab in time. Is that it? I need to return the slab. Oh no, rats! We all know when animals eat dead bodies, they usually go for the eyeballs first because they're the softest. Uh, there we go. That must be my eyeball being eaten. Ho 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 ho, that's grand. I like it. Keep it up. <laughs> Take that, you dumb fuck. Your stupid little eyeball. I love him better than all. I did not expect that. Okay. So, I, this game's fooled me before. I don't know if I'm supposed to die or not anymore when sequences like that happen, so... I don't know if I should be mad or... not. I don't want to get killed by King Ramses again, though, that's, that's for sure. 
Nothing. Okay. That's definitely something different. So I was supposed to die. Right? Return the slab. Are you pointing that way? What's over here for me? It's a trap, isn't it, asshole? I see you. I see you! Um... Do we have to do this all over again? So he is just killing me then, huh? Fuck you, Ramses! Teleporting right in front of me. Maybe I'm supposed to... I'm still whistling! Doggy! Here, doggy! What a stupid ass. Uh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Doggy, where are you, doggy? That's all I can think about. It's doggy. Okay, so what is this guy? Is he like a weeping angel? I have to keep my eyes on him or something? Some dumb shit. Weeping Angel shit's getting really old. Old. SCP Containment Breach already. SCP Containment Breach. I already kind of played that out. Wait, no. I've done this before. Maybe he says sprinting everywhere. I should try walking. Oh, he's doing a JoJo pose. Nice. I'm not sure where I'm supposed to be going now. There's no map here. Wow, he's a JoJo posing fool. Really. Nothing. Well, that scrolling problem's still here, so... What am I gonna do about it? Does he come out of the box? What a dumbass. So I keep my eyes on I keep my eyes on him and he won't teleport anymore. Got it. Hopefully he doesn't teleport on me at any point. Are we done with him? Or are we not? Going for the door. It's broken! A retina scan. Can I use it? Wait, I don't have that eyeball anymore. Wait, where'd he go? There he is, okay. So, he did kill me that one time. I have to go get that eyeball back, I'm sure. But the last time I went to go pick it up, it was gone. What the hell's going on? Take my time. Was it this corner? 
No. I check this heap. Is it a random heap? Nothing. I will check another heap. Fuck you, Ramses. I got my eye on you. Haha, <laughs> get it? Because of the rats. And the eye I'm looking for. All right, spawn somewhere. There he is. <laughs> In the box. Okay, I think it was this room. Being really careful not to run into this fool. I don't want to run into him anymore. Tired of dying. Okay. Got the stupid eye. Let's get the hell out of here. What? Oh man, I'm calling super bullshit on this game, dude. And it's gonna make me sit through all this. Oh man, just just when I'm starting to think better of this, it starts it starts it starts getting annoying again. And then I have to say I start hating it. I I don't think I like this game. And yes, this pacing is terrible. This shit takes way too long. For for something to happen again and again so easily. So what is it? Just chance then? I could just sprint through all this because there's a chance that he'll spawn on top of me or some shit. Yeah, I don't even think that's clever anymore. It's just annoying now. Wake up, you're the... Wait, what? No. That was close. Man, if I did that, I quit. <laughs> I mean, I'm about to quit now, but... I won't. I am pretty damn close, though. That's always going to be nothing. Keep that in mind. This is going to run. Maybe I should walk. Maybe I should stay close to the wall. Or... I don't know. I honestly don't know. If he's just gonna spawn on me and kill me like that. Like, can I even make it out of here with the fucking eye? Because there's a save point nearby. And if I could just save it with the eye... Wait, I'm taking a long way. I don't see him. Should I just run then? Should I just run? <sighs> you know, I'm just gonna skip this whole section until I actually get the damn eye. Until I get the damn eye and I get to a save point, I'm just gonna skip all this.
Okay, so I made it to the, made it to the save point and got the stupid eye. I didn't get killed this time because I just I sprinted through the whole thing. <laughs> this looks fucking stupid. He looks like the dude from Medieval. Medieval? Medieval? The game was awesome, by the way. It's getting an HD remake. Um, I'll probably play it. I know when Ghostbusters gets this HD remake, I'm playing the hell out of that. I loved that game. Broken. Uh-huh, okay. There's an eye now. Now he can see me. An elevator. Where is it taking me? It's taking me up. Take me home! <coughs> wow. Okay, so how long is this gonna take? Because this game is hallways and tunnels and then waiting sequences. I guess it's supposed to build tension, but all it does is build irritation for me. Especially when there's too many of them. I like how the light's flashing through my gun. Lost in Vivo. Yeah, is it over? No, it's not. I'm not falling for this game. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice. Fool me try. Fool. Fool me twice. Shame on me. I can't even English today. I can't. Oh yeah. By the way, new microphone. I uh, I like this microphone. My other one was pretty good, but uh, it had some problems with certain frequencies. I was beginning to notice to notice that while I was streaming, so I got this little beauty right here, and I like it. Hopefully, it's doing okay, or I'll have to do more extensive mic testing to make it sound just right. So, if my audio is a little off or sounds like shit or ass on here, I do apologize. Vulpus Delecti. That's the name of my computer. Vulpus Delecti. Vulpus Delecti. Vulpus Delecti. Kind of like Corpus Delecti. Which is uh, law terminology, means body of the crime. Like, um. Or you're gonna say evidence. Not be a fancy ass. Yeah, this wasn't any surprise. I'm puking bugs now. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it wasn't over. It's not a surprise anymore. Hunger. Hunger. Fuck you. Let go, asshole. I'm just gonna pretend I beat him up. Let me reload my ammo. Switch that four for a ten. Let's not ditch that zero. Hello, thank you. Hello, thank you. What else is there? There's a save point. 
There's another radio for tapes. I don't care. I really don't. I don't I don't care anymore. It's just gonna be more wannabe spoopy edgelord shit. I don't care. Nice room. If the power goes out in the tracks, you have to reboot the whole system. In order to do that, go to each section and turn off the breaker boxes. Then come back here and restart the system. I've barely been able to keep the power on. So that's all. That, that's about all the advice besides giving up that I can give. Wait, did I already read that? Or something like that? Did I already do power breaker box shit? A uh, map. Uh, cool. I'm gonna save it again so I don't have to pick up the map again because that's the type of, uh, type of gamer I am, I guess. I don't want to do the small feeble shit all over again. Okay, so what's my goal here? Is it breakers again? Or just run through like an idiot? Use. Uh, yeah, that looks like death. Where is this according to the map? Six or G, little G things. Ain't nothing but a G thing, y'all. So what direction is not the G room? Okay, so I think I want to go this way. That'll do. Oh, wow. Okay. Well, there's a little symbol right there going downward. It's stuck. Okay. That, it's rusted shut, and there was things that down, I guess. Wait, it took me back here. It's a big circle, I think. Yeah, that looks like a big circle. No, 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 it's not. I'm supposed to go this way. Then go this way, I will go. Hey, okay, read that. <clears throat> Spooky Stories for Kids, Volume 1. Once there lived a nasty old man in a nasty old house. The nasty old man wouldn't go outside. The nasty old man wouldn't play. He sat in his tub and soaked in all the water all day. Just him and his music enjoying the water, even though it was nasty and green. He soaked all the day and every night, but he never tried to get clean. But one day, the old man couldn't find his music. His radio was all filled with static. He twisted and turned and tried all the stations and things got a little dramatic. His radio fell down into the water and he missed the off switch. And the story goes that if you visit his house, the old, nas the old nasty corpse will still twitch. I don't know why I added nasty in there. I just felt like it. it felt appropriate. Oh, hi. What's up? What are you hoping 
to accomplish. Without Smoosh! Oh, God, time for that stupid eraser head shit. Um, return to slab. Maybe. Okay. Where am I going? feeling these were here for a reason. Okay, I get it. I think I get it. How do I get down there? Is it going to come back? Or is it just gone? Whatever. Stay gone. Yeah, I'm going back to that save point. I'm going to hit that. Yeah, that was a pretty, uh, pretty obvious mechanic. I had to stop there by, a, by that, that little electric switch box because I thought it was going to kill me if I ran through it. So I sat there and I looked for it, at it for, for a little bit. Then I noticed the screen started getting all wobbly. And then big ass dude. Kaboom. Okay, so I haven't been down here before. At least I don't think. Spooky Stories for Kids, Volume 2. There once lived a nice man in his house. There once lived a nice man with his nice old dog. The nice man was content. Just him and his dog. Watching it years pass by. I don't care. I don't care. If you want to read it, pause it. Okay. think you're getting better does doing this even have a purpose yeah um okay i'm a dog now a dog that turns very slowly Fuck this dog, dude. I'm tired. I'm, I'm so tired of this. Just fucking Blaster Master shit. Doing all this just to get your fucking frog back. Well, at least Blaster Master was a much better game. All of them. All of them. Including part two. Including the PS1 game. All of them are better than this. There's a word bark. I think I'm supposed to follow the whistles, but I can't really tell. Can't tell where they're coming from. That one sounded like it came from the left, so... Left? Hmm. 
the right. No. Uh, it sure would be nice if the sound was more dynamic. But no. And I do have a good pair of headphones. A really good pair of headphones. This game just wants to be ass. This is boring, this is boring, this is boring, it's not creepy, it's not scary, it's not fun, just boring. Why? Why am I making myself suffer through this? I guess it's because I'm already, I've already made it this far, I may as well just see it to the end. But damn it, I'm never playing this game ever again. I'm uninstalling this shit hard. I'm never playing anything Silent Hill related ever again unless it's actually Silent Hill. Because all it tells me is it's going to be slow, monotonous, and boring. Like most Silent Hill games are. I don't care what anyone says. I don't like part two. I speed ran that game, beat it a thousand times, beat it only getting hit twice. Because one part you have to take damage when, um, uh, Pyramid Head or the Boogeyman. To be more correct, knocks you off the roof of the hospital. You have to take damage there. So I, I played it a bunch. I just don't really care for it. And it caught me at, at my most vulnerable moment in my life when I was incredibly bored and had nothing else to do. I'm a little bit of a black sheep when it comes to the Silent Hill series anyways. Um, my favorite ones are part one and part four. I understand, I know, part 4 gets a lot of shit for not really being a Silent Hill game. But that's probably why I liked it. Because it wasn't a Silent Hill game. But part 1. Part 1 is... That's a gem. That's golden. Golden, my friends. I loved it. Is there a map button for the dog? Because I kind of feel like there needs to be. Kind of open doors. Yeah, let's just say he opened that door with his dog hands. What's up with that? Should I open it? There's something beating the door. Oh! Oh! Quit whistling, you asshole! Where do I go? It's like I'm stuck in here. Alright, I'm gonna fight back. <sighs> this game, dude. This damn game. Yeah.